four score and seven pieces of candy a go. Give me your tired, your poor, your delicious treats yearning to be in my tummy. Mm, patriotic, but unlikely to generate maximum candy collection. Oh, yeah? We're also a mermaid and a pirate. And salt and pepper shakers. This way we can hit each house three times. That means three times the candy. Yes, I am familiar with basic multiplication. Your strategy is cute, but mine is far superior. Going as a kangaroo? <laughs> I doubt it. Kangaroo plus baby roo. <gasps> Precisely. That awe factor will increase my candy revenue exponentially. And the best part is, she only has one tooth, so I don't have to share. Snap out of it, Lana. Lincoln, Clyde, get your butts out here! I thought you guys were going as Ace Savvy and One-Eyed Jack. Uh, we are. We're Ace and Jack undercover, trying to crack the case of the missing crumpets. Boy, you guys really don't want candy, do you? Okay, first shot, me and Lynn in the tub. And this time, we're not taking any chances. I'm gonna use film and print hard copies. Whatever, nerd. Who uses film anymore? Think fast! Oh. Clyde, what gives? Sorry, Lincoln. Just getting into character. It's an actor thing. Okay. Light's good. Water's good. Props are ready. Timer set. Submarine destroyer! Oh, man, you farted? It felt right, and I went with it. Next up, Lori feeding me my first ice cream. Chair is at optimal height. Ice cream is mint chocolate chip. Diaper is snug, but not restrictive. Clyde, I'm ready for you on set. Clyde? <sighs> Actors. Ah! <laughs> Next up, my first mechanical pony ride with Lucy and Luann. I could have played both roles. He didn't have to hire an amateur. What's up, players? Lucy Loud is in the house. Rusty, a little acting tip. Lucy would never say that. You just worry about your Lola. I'm Luann. Did you at all prepare for this? Guys, let's just get the shot. <laughs> wow, that's really putting the cart before the horse. <laughs> get it? <laughs> you can make fun of me later. Right now, I've got Pop Pop on video chat, and he wants to see all of us. I'll go say hi right now. Hello, I already was you. And I was you too. I need a Lynn and a Lenny. Stat. And I got a new outfit for half off, which was weird because none of it was missing. <laughs> Pop Pop wants to talk to Lisa. Lisa's not home yet. She is now. Go. But I knew I was missing one key component, and that was sodium... Uh, sofa cushion. Have I seen Lori yet? Bring me the, uh, the funny one again. Uh, I forgot to tell Lily something. No, it was Lenny. Or was it Lisa? Who are you supposed to be? Uh, Lon... See? What animal does Mary have? A lamb with the fleece as white as snow. Phew. Oh, good. It's really you, son. Are you sure Luann didn't follow you? Definitely. I took four different buses. Plus, I've got Clyde doing surveillance on her. With the moon, moon here and moon, moon there. Uh, I believe I said he had a pig. With an oink, oink, cute, and an oink. How's my homework coming, Lise? 
I'm up to the letter S. Hmm, makes the macaroni a little crooked. I don't want my teacher getting suspicious. <laughs> Jester, how about a joke? Why do chicken coops only have two doors? Because if they had four, they'd be chicken sedans. Ha, 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 ha. Get it? Yes! <laughs> Isn't this fun, everyone? <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Loud House Theater production of Weekend at Aunt Ruth's. This pudding expired four years ago. You waste that in its litter box duty for you. One day later... Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today to say farewell to our sister Luna. If only her pudding had been as fresh as her jams. And now, another play entitled Weekend at a Luxury Spa Hotel. What a beautiful business center. Sister, keep your voice down. We must be respectful of other guests. Golly, our kids are so well behaved. And since we took them on this nice trip, maybe they won't put us in a nursing home when we're older. I take it you kids want to go to the hotel this weekend. Look, kiddos, this is the first chance your mother and I have had to relax in a long time. But Dad, we'll be so good. You won't even know we're there. We promise. <laughs> Game over, Ace Savvy and One-Eyed Jack. Think again, Wild Card Willy. I've got a few more cards up my sleeve. <laughs> All right, girls, let's deal with these losers. The High Card! Get them! You take the baby, I'll take the princess. The Queen of Diamonds! Diamonds. Ah. Hey. The Deuce! Get ready to do the bad guy shuffle! The Nightclub! No aces in this hole. The Eight of Spades! 52 pick up! The Strong Suits! Precisely six. Make that seven. The card counter! Hey guys, check out my new outfit. It's perfect for fall weather and springing into action. Ugh, oh, these belts are so 90s. The 11 of hearts! Wild card's getting away! Hey Willie, go fish! The royal flush! Joker! Willie, why do you always have to play dirty cards? Cause that's the only way to clean up. So I guess it's off to jail for me. Fafa? Cheer up, baby, don't you cry. No more tears, it's cheer up time. Look with me. Well, we might be doing this for the rest of our lives, but at least Lily's happy again. Here you go, your honor. And here's our new turkey. Aren't you excited, Lily? We've all been pardoned by Lori, and now it's your turn. Aww. Can you dudes imagine a Thanksgiving skit without our bad judge? I sure can't. Me neither. She's our MVP. Fashion emergency. Fashion emergency. Dr. Lenny's on it. <gasps> oh, um, gosh. A striped shirt with polka dot leggings? That is a fashion emergency. Don't worry. You're in good hands. Woo! Fashion emergency averted. Oh, would you look at the time? Let's just turn in and get this night over with. 
What do you mean? It's still early and you have a fun new roommate. Yeah, Luce Libre! I can't see anything! It's Magic Lynn off the third turnbuckle! What? What? I can't hear anything either! You're out. Yeah, Lunatic Glenn is out champion del mundo. Can we just go to sleep? There's less pain involved. At ease. Just kidding! Nobody is to be at ease in my presence! As you know, Mom and Dad left me in charge. That means you have to do as I say. Whether you're tall, short, or covered in fur and can only understand the word sit, Look, I'll play a barista, but I am not wearing suspenders. This has to look like a real coffee shop. Now, do you want to ride to the comic book store later or not? <sighs> okay, so now you guys pretend to laugh at something I've just said. Ooh, was it coffee-related humor? It doesn't matter, Luann. Maybe you said this. Why'd the hipster burn his tongue? He sipped his coffee before it was cool. <laughs> well, I've never seen Charles do that before. That's because it's not Charles, Lincoln. <laughs> it's me! <laughs> Wait, Lily is the prankster? Ah. Wow, this is all really impressive, Lily. The whipped cream, the toilet rocket. Luann, focus! Oh, right, sorry. Lily, you've got to call off your grand finale right this minute. No, the what? <laughs> Lucy didn't work out. Neither did Lynn. Water, you say? We add some melon. Yeah! Oh! <laughs> Poor Lenny. Why are clowns never bored? Because we're good at keeping occupied. <clears throat> I said, good at keeping occupied. Lisa. Hey, birthday boy, why don't you take the seat of honor? <laughs> oh, no, no one eat that cake. It clearly causes gastrointestinal distress. Well, I am so honored to be your fifth choice. Operation Sneak into her yearbook group photo so, so we're, we're not, not forgotten, forgotten like Marty What's-His-Face is a go. Okay, everyone, get ready. Psst, your powdered wig is crooked. Here, let me fix it. No biggie, there's more than one group photo in the yearbook. What's next? Chess Club! Okay, everyone, get ready. Don't mind us, just two chess guys coming through. Why is no one else dressed for chess? Not everyone has our commitment. Oops. Ah! Oof. Well, shoot. What else we got? Okay, not my first choice, but we're desperate. Morticians, Morticians Club. Club! We're in. Yeah! You guys are not part of this club. Hold on, Lucy. Yeah! We can always use some more bodies. Okay, smile or whatever. No, oh, come on! So, Mr. Loud, why should we hire you? Because I've literally mastered technology. Hi, Boo Boo Bear. Carol said what? Can I get some privacy? You should hire me because I'm responsible and mature. This tie is strangling me. Oh, I'm sweating in this suit. These pants are giving me a rash. Ah, now where were we? Lin Loud Senior, pleased to meet you. What's the buzz around here? <laughs> Get it? Who are we kidding? None of us can pull this off. Aloha, Lincoln. What's that? It's your homework. All done. Uh, you did it? I did. Phew, 
I mean, not that it matters. <gasps> Hiya, Lincoln! Tippy the cow! Well, that's right! And guess what I have for my favorite fan? You did my laundry? Wow, thanks, Tippy! Because this isn't Frank, it's a hairball too! Which means Frank could still be alive! Ah! Spider! And it sounds like Lenny just found him! Uh, that wasn't Lenny. I know that scream. <coughs> oh, hi, Mr. Loud. Trick or treat! Ah! Spider! I'm all right. We're going to be on the show! All aboard, orange iguanas! Next stop, Orlando! Whoa! Awesome costume, Dad! Orange iguana put yours on, too. Now let's get a move on. I have a feeling it's going to take a while to get through airport security. <laughs> How's that? Hmm, not quite there. I think we need to lose a limb. No, Lucy, no! Here, Lynn, don't forget your chainsaw. Ah! A little homemade blood and you're good to go. You're a real pro, honey. I should have let you do this years ago. That's okay, Mom. I'm just glad to finally get my chance. I'm so thrilled I can barely contain myself. I know, honey. I can see it all over your face. I literally want to suck your blood. Hmm, missing something. Fangs here. <laughs> if you want to make it more authentic, he could bite your neck. No, I mean, this is fine. <laughs> Hang on, Luann. Your monster needs more stitches. That's so much better. <laughs> Get it? No puns in the maze. Looks great, Lenny, but don't forget this. <gasps> Why do I have to look so pale? You've just been decapitated. Well, I'd still put on some blush. <gasps> Ready to rock! Oh, mistress of the dark. Drop down an octave and try it in D minor. That's the spookiest key. Okay, guys, the Loud Family Haunted Corn Maze is officially open. Let's bring on the screams, people. Lola, guard this door. No one goes in, no one comes out. <laughs> Say goodbye to the Queen of No. And hello to the King of Yes! <laughs> Would you like to meet my little angels? Oh, children! I'm Lori. I'm Lenny. Luna, at your service. I'm Luann. Lynn Lau Jr. Lincoln. Hello, I'm Lucy. Lana, nice to meet you. Lola Loud. Charmed, I'm sure. Lisa Loud, PhD. Really? Well, aren't you all a delight? Now tell me, what's it like having a mom like yours? Excellent question, dude. Uh, ma'am. Lincoln? Hey, Lynn. Want to hear my new poem? It's called Space. Space. Deep, black, endless. Like my heart. Space. Mind invaded. Torn apart. This is the real me, Lynn. I can understand if you don't want to be my roommate anymore. Oh. <laughs> oh, that is the best impression of Lucy ever! You are so funny, Ruby! <laughs> Introducing Luann Loud and her amazing dummy, Lilil. Say, Lily, who's your favorite singer? Lady Gaga. What's your favorite Hawaiian platter? Boo -boo. That was an awesome celebration of senseless destruction! Right? Bro handshake! I told you you guys would hit it off. How do we end this? I have no idea. Ta-da! A one-on-one -on -one dingy date. <laughs> sort of. Wow, just like the dreamboat. It's so romantic, babe. I know, because we're so romantic. I mean, we literally have such a great connection, don't you think? Totally, and I was gonna tell you... <laughs> My mangoes! My mango guy's in trouble. I'm sorry, babe. Bodega business calls. <sighs> the burglar! Chill, banana boy. I'm training Charles to be a vicious guard dog. I'm the burglar. Attack, boy! <laughs> Look, I'm stealing your food. 
Charles? Hmm, what is this, chipped beef? Phase three, look like a grown-up. I think my work here is done. Ready for the grown-up table, big guy? Did Napoleon have a Napoleon complex? <laughs> <laughs> I still don't get it. Me neither. Cheese! My jaw's cramping up. Give it a second. I knew he'd blow it. Let's do selfies instead. Toast? No, wait. <laughs> I know just what this picture needs. <laughs> Come on, Luann. You can't wear those in the photo. Oh, don't be such a groucho. Got my dancing shoes on, and I am ready to get down and get back up again. Oh. State your names and business. Sorry, new security measures. You hear that, honey? New security measures. I think I've really gotten through to the kids. Thank you, Bobby. Sorry, Mr. and Mrs. Loud, but before you go dancing, I really do need your names and business. Uh, you just said our names and business. Dang it! I gotta stop doing that. Back! Back! Punch the hairdresser! Got him! By a hair. Ha-ha! <laughs> he was a goner. When that chair spun around, I peed a little. I'm gonna write my weekly fan letter to Hunter right now while I'm still excited. Don't forget to tune in next week for more of ARG's tour of the 25 most haunted places in America. We'll be visiting a spooky groundskeeper's house at a cemetery in Royal Woods, Michigan. Did he just say Royal Woods, Michigan? No, I peed a little. I'm having such a neat time here at Gus's Games and Grub. I wish the fun would never end. <gasps> <laughs> Why, it's the teeny genie here to grant my wish for more tokens. <laughs> now for a limited time at Gus's Games and Grub. Get 20 free tokens with the purchase of... <laughs> This is giving me a migraine. Yeah, and I'm getting a headache. <gasps> Wait, is that my missing jelly sandal under the couch? <gasps> Woohoo! <gasps> and my missing ring! <gasps> and Lucy, I found your creepy dolls. Give me those. We should def do this every week. We'll never lose anything again. Sigh. So sorry, Mr. Coconut. Without me, you're just a hand. Hey, I bring the bunny. You're only... <sighs> 98, 99. Whoa, where'd you get all that money, Luann? Did you sell laughter? <laughs> Laughter? It's my pleasure to give that away for free. This is from Selling Balloon Animals. Observe. <gasps> a dog! Now pick up the pace, Fido. It's the leash you can do. <laughs> my 12 puns of Christmas are off to a great start. I've only got to come up with 11 myrrh. <laughs> Make that 10. <laughs> hey, Lincoln. Look, I just made the perfect Christmas outfit. Has anyone seen my plaid? Christmas tablecloth? What seems to be the problem? Lana's supposed to be guarding my princess tower, not attacking it! Now, Lana... Uh, guarding is boring! Attacking is cool! <laughs> there I was, about to perform at the Little Miss Cheese Curd pageant. My heart was going a mile a minute. But I was able to calm myself down by using four, seven, eight breathing. Breathe in for four seconds, hold it in for seven, then breathe out for eight. Cheese! Okay, lucky playoff beards are locked and loaded. Hands in! What time is it? Uh, it's 12.30. Ah! No, it's game time! Go, go, go! <gasps> Get it together, loud. Let's seize the mepper. Ah! And we are closed. <sighs> Dad? Oh. Mom? I thought you were coming back tomorrow. Well, no one bothered to tell me that the Renaissance Fair was vegan and I was only packing meat. So we saddled up our steed. Vanzilla. And set out for our castle. The house, which looks great, Lenny. There's only one hole in the floor. I knew no job would be too big for my employee of the month. Oh, thanks.
Thanks, Mom. Do I get more cake? How about a half-eaten mutton leg? Ah! Ho, ho, ho! Relax, Flip, okay? I was just leaving for work. No, 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 it's Christmas. The food and fuel is closed today. You got the day off, kiddo. And that debt, it's paid in full. <laughs> Boop! Ho, ho, ho! We're living! Fear not, senior citizens! We have the solution to your putting problem. Cookies! These are fantastic! Okay, so we know Luna's exact itinerary for tonight's mayhem. If we can stay one step ahead of her and Roxy, we can thwart all of their plans without Luna ever finding out we're onto her. Awesome! Sweet. Hey, how am I supposed to relieve myself in this thing? There's no zipper! I still don't know why Mr. C was crucial to the mission, but come on. <sighs> Lesson 12, avoiding road hazards. There's a squirrel in the road. What do you do? <laughs> ah! 